You can manifest the life of your dreams by having the self-image in your mind. Welcome or welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Summer Monet and this is a space where we talk about law of attraction, self-development, and Buddhism. In today's video, we are going to talk about five ways that you can manifest the life of your dreams just by self-image. Before we get started, I would truly appreciate it if you guys like this video, give me a thumbs up, make sure you subscribe, and make sure that your bell notifications are on so you know every time I post. So if you are excited to get into today's video, then please keep on watching. Okay guys. Guys, so one thing I want to say before I give you guys the five ways that you can start to manifest the life of your dreams by self-image I just want to talk to you guys about law of attraction again So what law of attraction is it tells you that your thoughts and emotions are Aligning with the vibration that will align you with the things that are on that vibration that are on that frequency So what is ba that is basically telling you is that you have the key you have the remote control to controlling this whole experience that we are living. We are put on this earth to live an abundant life and nothing less than that. As you start to alter how you view yourself, how, once you start to alter how you view your thoughts, you are going to see the changes in your outer experience. The first way today that you are going to create the life of your dreams is by visualization. That is one thing I always, always, always talk about on my channel. It is one of the most powerful ways to manifest the life of your dreams. Why is that? Visualization, when you start to change your thought of process, when you start to have the evolution of self, you will start to see it in your outer experience. So the first step to visualizing is that you have to sit down and make sure that you have this time to yourself. Make sure that you are not going to be distracted and make sure it's going to be a quiet place. You're going to settle down. You're going to settle into your body and close your eyes. And you're going to take deep breaths until you start to feel really grounded visualizing yourself having the things you want to have start visualizing yourself wearing the clothes you desire to wear start visualizing yourself talking to the people you want to talk with who are going to you know take you to the success levels that you have never imagined one thing I will have to say is that when it comes to visualizing you it's about feeling it's not just about seeing the picture but how are you feeling Feeling about it do you really feel yourself in that business every day talking to your team do you feel yourself actually on that mountain actually on that vacation visualizing is so fun and it's so creative and it's all up to you the more often that you have time to yourself each and every day to focus on a manifestation I promise you that it is going to manifest so the more that you're able to visualize your subconscious mind won't be able to understand the difference between what is what you are consciously and subconsciously putting in every single day when you can it is going to fulfill it to you in such magnificent ways the second way today you are going to start manifesting that self-image is you are going to start dressing for success you heard me say it start dressing in the way that makes you feel so good you want to present yourself physically in a way that is matching that person that you are visualizing yourself to be it has to be consistent with what you desire what is it that you like to show up as how do you like to express yourself I one thing I have to say is that I don't get dressed for people I don't get dressed for the compliments of people I get dressed for me because I want to make sure that I feel good because when I feel good I get to show up as my best self no matter who I'm interacting with the third way today that we are going to start incorporating that self-image into our life, you are going to act as if. This is probably one of my most favorite tools and strategies to manifesting. When it comes to acting as if, I want you guys to pick three people, three people that you admire, that inspire you. Pick one trait from each person and start incorporating that trait into your daily life. Start showing up as that person. Start learning. It's it is always about being a student in this life that we are living. That's what makes it more fun. Once you learn something, there's always more to learn. There's always ways to improve. So start acting as if the person you want to be, how do they speak? How is their rapport with people? How are their listening skills? How do they present themselves? What is the tone how they speak? What is the vibration of energy you feel when they present themselves to you? Once you decide the energy you want for yourself, you will start to act as if, and I promise 
promise you, you are going to start to see that energy starting to flow. You're going to start saying, I am becoming the person that I desire to be. I am the person I desire to be. I am my best self and I love myself. Once you get to that point, I promise you, you are really going to just be in this everlasting, beautiful unfolding of life. The fourth way today that we are going to learn about self-image and how to manifest, we are going to write down the manifestation. I want you guys to burn the past, get rid of it, stop living in the past, stop living in your mind, and start creating in present tense the desires of your life. The big, one of the most biggest affirmations that are so magnetic to attaching you to that vibration of that desire. I am so happy and grateful now that. Once you start off that journal prompt with that manifestation following up behind it, I promise you the more you talk about it, the more you have gratitude for it, the more you write it down, and the more you visualize and the more you just sit and in tune with it you really are going to be sending those signals to your subconscious mind and it is going to have to bring it to you and the last way today that we are going to talk about manifesting that life manifesting the person you see yourself being you're going to say yes you're going to say yes to the universe you are going to say yes to yourself saying yes to new experiences and opportunities and people people will allow you to elevate your life start saying no to the old get rid of the old and in with the new start saying yes and showing up for yourself start saying yes and i promise you you are going to see opportunities unfold into your life when you put yourself out there and you show the universe that you are confident and you are capable it will bring those things to you we have these gifts we have the gift of life we have the gift of breath and we have the gift of our heart you can absolutely manifest time and time and time again once you start making that conscious choice once you get clear once you start visualizing once you start dressing up as a person once you start acting as if and once you write it down and once you say yes saying yes to the idea saying yes to the manifestation happening in the most wonderful way for you when you demand and declare to the universe how grateful you are and how abundant you are it will showcase that to you the more you want to receive be more giving so i just really wanted to share this video with you guys i i really just felt like right now in my life personally I am starting to show up as someone I've always desired to be and one thing I have to say it is scary it is nerve-wracking okay I have to be honest with that but I got inspired to share this video with you today because it was that act as if part that really got me going and that's my favorite out of all of the tips I gave today that is my favorite if you had to ask me act as if present yourself being that way show up in your life and I really it's like it's such a it's so beautiful how we can decide and how we always can choose we can always choose every moment of every day we can choose what we're going to put our energy towards we're going to choose what positive energies we're going to align with in every video I truly like affirming so in today's affirmation is going to be I am so happy and grateful of the person I am becoming I am so happy and grateful of the person I am becoming I am so happy and grateful of the person that I am becoming I want you guys to be more in tune with yourself have more self-love and understand that it is you it is all up to you all of the time where you're gonna go continue to have that key in your hand and in your heart continue to open up yourself to receive the guidance along the way and i promise you you are going to bask in bliss also i want to say my birthday is june 6th so if anybody wants to send me some happy birthday love i will definitely love it and i would definitely appreciate it i continue to send love light and grace to you guys and i will see you in the next video bye bye